Welcome. This is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Design. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the month of April. The month of April is the energy of justice. So we're calling up on the angels and guides of the Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rock, and Sun to come in. Thank you so much for the like, shares, and support. And I'm making sure that these videos are out. My apologies for last month. But see what is happening. I know the video quality is good, but for the moment, we are with us. We're dealing with this, okay? So, you Capricorns, let's see an injustice and deceptive things that has transpired. Everything is coming out. So, let's see what's happening for the Capricorn. The month has four weeks. So, let's see for the Capricorn in the first week. Justice, justice, justice. It is the energy of the month. And it is the energy of what is transferring and what is coming out. So the first week, there is. A, let's see what else is coming out in the second week. The second week, um, we have justice against a corporation, or justice against your ex-boss or your boss, justice against someone in power. Whatever the situation is, is that uh, um, you could be either power and justice is going to prevail over this situation okay so obviously it is a situation that some of you have been unjustly um accused or unjustly something was unjustly done against some of you capricorns and now the balancing out is coming in the first and second week let's see what's coming up in the third week we have the wheel of fortune and this is a positive energies so this is wonderful um, for you capricorns uh, some of you are going to be very 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 unsuccessful in business okay um the wheel of fortune is going to be uh, bringing out a lot of successful for a lot of you who are in business for the rest of you some of you could be getting high promotional jobs in um the month of april with these three energies that is here this is going to be a very very positive month let's see what else is at the end of the month um for you capricorns um because let's see what is going to be coming out after this because the energies are so powerful for you guys wow thank you thank you thank you so wonderful month for you capricorns especially the capricorns who are very psychic especially the capricorns who are dismantling the liars the deceptive people and the injustice around them this is a very positive energy to end the month on because um you are ending the month where you're taking down and removing the lies the deception the people who have been playing games you are showing open up um things to show people that there has been this honesty whoopsie daisy you care free corn oh my god oh capricorns 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 especially the capricorns who has been going through a orb and angels and universe is saying you are going to be successful over an injustice situation that has transpired against you success is going to be yours now this energy flew out as the the, the next energy and that is going to be effect is it the lawyers is it the judge is it the people who were in justice and they're saying it is the people who have been unjustly accused um is now can't be too so um it's it's mostly for people that is not in the legal field this is what they're saying mostly for people who are not in the legal field success is going to be coming in for a lot of people at work um a lot of you are going to wheel of fortune what is there and the energy of the star this is a wonderful wonderful positive positive and it's going to be the center of your month okay and as as if you guys are going to be regaining your energy um your solar black chakras are going to be healed you're going to be balancing out your energies because then and there your solar black chakras are healing 
So you're regaining and taking back your energy. The energy of the King of Cups comes up. So um, this is um, a situation where someone who is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion who is coming from a past lifetime could be a silent enemy, and you weren't aware of this. So this person is a Pisces, going to be very successful over this person because you're having faith, faith in the universe, faith in the universe, and um. The angels and guides are just pushing, letting go and let, and, and, and you're just letting go. Whatever is transpiring, you're letting go, letting go as, as if you're saying, okay, I've come to a point where I'm asking my guides and angels and the universe to intervene in whatever that is happening. Whoa, okay. What is happening? There is a situation about a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion. Whoever the Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion is, so it's as if you were thinking about this person, and this can be a mother figure who is a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion, or um, it could be a friend. It could be someone in your life that is going to be affecting you and. There is a situation where you are very, very successful over this person. Okay, so this could be a boss. This could be someone who you have been working with, or someone who was, um, you know, working against you, or whatever the situation is. But you are going to be very successful over this person. So there's a lot of water sign that you're dealing with, um, you Capricorns. Whatever the situation is, and whatever it is transpiring, there's a lot of water sign. Because you have the energy of uh, the male and female, Pisces and Cancer, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpion that you're dealing with, and you're seeing the truth to a situation with a lady. You're definitely seeing the truth with a situation with a lady. Whoever this lady is, definitely seeing the truth with a situation with a lady. Okay, so the energy of uh, the sun and the star, this is just so powerful. Energy of the situation. You're going to be seeing the truth of the situation. You're spiritually protected and guided. And with your intuition, you're going to be seeing the truth. You're protected from someone who's a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Okay? All right, let's see. Whoever this lady is, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, some of you have really some regrets with this lady, which we are going to be going forward to check out to see what is this all about because uh, um there is going to be the extended reading that is going to be coming up and we're going to be checking out where this is going to be affected because uh, some of you are dealing with a pisces cancer or a scorpion from a past lifetime or it could be your mom it could be a friend it could be a girlfriend it could be but whoever it is these water sign people you guys are definitely having some situation with okay Let's see what is going to be coming out for the Capricorns. For the, I don't know, you can't free calls. Okay, um, these two three cards came out. So obviously, this month is good. It's definitely a month of balance. Okay, and judgment over um, people with ego base and the material world. So um, this, what this could be saying is that there was some blocks. That um, was there, and there was outside forces that was blocking your potential fold, and judgment is going to be coming down on them. Okay, wow, this is a lot because here we have um, the energy of judgment on outside forces, and at the end of the month, you are dealing and you're sitting down and you're picking away and breaking away. Um, the people who no longer serve you in your life, the people who has been silently, um, you know, blocking your progress. And some of you um, could be dealing with, sorry, some of your Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, because here you're seeing this situation coming up. And Whatever the situation is, is that the energy of the devil 
as, as if there's the judgment call that is going to be coming down on, um, it could be another Capricorn, that there is going to be some judgment call that is coming down on another Capricorn. And some of you could be, um, could have Capricorn friends in your life and this, this person. And uh, a judgment call is going to be coming up on you, okay? So you could have done something um, against this Capricorn person and a judgment call is going to come in going to be coming up on you so um for the extended to find out what is going to be transpired for the extended reader um check out the extended reader, okay there is definitely going to this simple situation that is going on okay there could be people coming in and out of your house when you're not there and it has to do with a capricorn um some of you, you could be a lawyer or someone, and you're paying people to go inside someone else. You're going to be caught because it's as if they know what is happening. Oh my God, you can't be. Can't be. Okay, so the energy of the house, um, there is um, love at home. Um, some of you are going to be receiving a lot of love. Um, there's definitely love um, a new uh, place um, some of you could be definitely definitely finding a new home if you were looking for a new home it's definitely going to be happening in this month okay so some of you who were looking for a new place to live it's definitely going to be happening not to worry a jealousy about money but this is coming to an end a lot of lies and jealousy about money there's some of you where you're going to be finding out that someone is jealous of something that you have. And it could be a house. Um, definitely someone is jealous of something that you have. It could be this other Capricorn person. So you need to be um, aligned and realize because you can be, there could be two people who's carrying the same sun, moon, and rising. Maybe one is the moon, one is the sun. They're friends and that sort of a thing. But one is out of balance, and this person is not seeing that they're out of balance. And they're carrying, they have befriended another Capricorn, and they're carrying so much jealousy for this person. And the other person is, is a very nice person, um, very open, very nice, very honest. And this guy is as if um, it's a karmatic situation. It's as if. Um, the other Capricorn just distinctly hates this person, and you are going to be finding out that um, a Capricorn that some of you that is in friends with, they're going to be caught. They're definitely going to be caught. And some of you are going to realize that you were supposed to receive a lot of money, and because of this person, she. Um, and it's a she. I'm getting a female energy that she is the one who kind of block it, but it, it it's still coming. There is some regret, so we're going to be looking at that to be um, sure. But there, this, whoever, if you are in a friendship with a Capricorn, be aware of this. So, um, one of the I, and, and 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 the person who is listening to this is going to know exactly who that person is because they're jealous over you and, and a relationship that you have with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. Um, uh, some of you are going to be finding out that you had a friend that was a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, and this person tried to get involved with this person. But it's as if you're like, seriously? Ooh, okay. Uh, been there, done that. Bye, have it. You know? And, and, and it's as if this information or something. But you knew from the beginning your intuition said, don't trust this person. And you did not trust this person. And, you know, the person go in and out of your life. And some of you just made a decision and think no more. You know, um, I know you're not being very honest with me, and I'm being very honest, and I'm being being there for you, and be nice. You're, you know, 
be very deceptive, whatever the situation is. Anyway, for the extended reading, please connect with us because I gotta find out what is going on for the extended reading. Okay, we have two energies. We have number 11, which is justice, and we have number um, nine. So obviously, um, spiritual justice, karmatic justice is the energy of this month. Okay, karmatic justice is the energy of this month. The month, card one and card two, choose one of these cards. Okay, and just the month spirit surrender now. Surrender, surrender, surrender now, surrender, whatever is happening, surrender now. The second energy is the number nine point five from the parrot spirit. Watch your words, watch your words. The parrot spirit, watch your words. Okay, the parrot spirit, watch your words. So um, that is something now. Your activation code is the activation of allowance number nine. So a lot of a lot of nines came of whatever is happening. A lot of nine came of whatever the situation is. A lot of nines came of whatever that was happening, what was transpiring. A lot of nine came of whatever the situation is or was. Um, you are going to be in this month uh, allowance, okay? And the energy of allowance is inviting us to be open to whatever comes our way without judgment, without opinions, without fear, and without resistance. When we allow the universe to become our partner in the wondrous um, dance of existence and expansion, okay? So this is going to be the really wonderful. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm wishing you a wonderful, wonderful. Um, um time and i'm hoping the best for you guys namaste remember to pick up your extended reading because this is going to be what you guys namaste